Chapter 1 Hardware and Software Learning Outcomes At the end of this chapter, students will be able to Differentiate between hardware and software Define the main parts of the computer Classify the computer parts into input, output and storage devices Learn about the working of all parts of the computer in detail. Warm up. Identify and circle the name of the things you cannot see and touch. Answer. Circle wind, sound. Teacher's note. A prize student that something which a person can see, feel or touch and have a physical existence are called tangible things whereas the intangible is something which a person cannot see, feel or touch and thus do not have any of the physical existence. Hello! We already know about the basics of computers. Now we will learn about the functions of each part of the computer in detail. Now it is time to learn more about this wonderful machine. Key parts of a computer. We already know that a computer is an electronic device that can do many tasks simultaneously. A computer system has different parts that together make it work. Based on processing, computer parts are divided into two groups. Hardware, software. Hardware The part of the computer that can be seen and touched are called hardware. Hardware refers to all electronic and mechanical parts of the computer system. Further, computer hardware parts are classified as follows. Input Devices Output Devices Storage Devices Input Devices a computer always needs a set of instructions to work. It cannot work on its own. The devices through which instructions are fed into the computer system are called input devices. For example, keyboard is used to give instructions to the computer by typing. Other input devices are a mouse, microphone, web camera, light pan and joystick. Keyboard Keyboard is the most common input device. Data and instructions are entered into the computer using its keys. There are different layouts of keyboard available like QWERTY, VEST and Dvorak. Amongst these layouts, QWERTY is the most commonly used layout. VEST keyboard is mostly used by gamers. A keyboard has different types of keys. These keys are small buttons on the keyboard keys. Some of the important keys are alphabetical keys. A, B, C, Z are alphabet keys. There are 26 alphabet keys. Numerical keys 0, 1, 2, 0 are numerical keys. There are 10 numerical keys. Do you know? Some keyboards are designed for thumb usage. On most keyboards, you type using all your fingers. There are some keyboards, however, that are designed specifically for thumb usage known as thumb-sized keyboards. They were popular during the early 2000s. Space Bar This key is used to insert space between the letters. It is the longest key on the keyboard. Backspace. This key is used to delete any character before the current position of the cursor. Arrow keys. These keys are used to move the cursor positions in all directions. Mouse. A computer mouse is an input device that is used with a computer. It is a pointing device that can move the cursor to different items on the screen. Mouse has two buttons, the left button and the right button, with the scroll wheel. Today, 
Many computers use wireless technology and have no wire. Let me answer. Differentiate between a house mouse and the computer's mouse. There are two types of mouse namely wired or wireless. A wired mouse. A wired mouse is that type of mouse that has a wire. It is connected to a computer or a laptop directly. The transfer of information takes place through the wire. Wireless mouse. It does not have any wire. It is not connected directly to any system. The transfer of information takes place in the form of radio signals. Optical mouse. An optical mouse uses a light emitting diode LED. Movement is detected by sensing changes in reflected light. Microphone Microphone is an input device that is used to record any sound or voice. It converts sound into an electrical signal. Web Camera A webcam is a camera that connects to the computer and captures still pictures or motion videos. Let me answer. Can you do video calling on a PC using a web camera? Light Pen A light pen is a light sensitive pointing input device that is used to draw things on the computer screen. Scanner A scanner is an input device that is used to scan any document and print and print it on paper. We can also save the document on the computer. Output devices Monitor A monitor is an output device that shows the work which we do on a computer. It also displays the result and movement of the mouse pointer on the screen. It is also known as VDU, Visual Display Unit. There are three types of monitors. 1. CRT Cathode ray tube. These monitors are big in size and consume more power. 2. LCD. Liquid crystal display. These are the monitors with flat screens which consume less power. 3. LED. Light emitting diode. These monitors have a better display. They are thinner and lighter in weight. They consume 40% less power than LCD. CRT monitor, LCD monitor, LED monitor. Printer It is a hardware output device that allows a user to print items on paper. Many printers can also work as photocopiers. Laser printers Laser printers produce high quality text and graphics to print text and images onto the paper. It uses a focused beam of light. Laser printer, inkjet printer, solid ink printer. Inkjet printers. These are also called bubble jet printers and print both documents and high quality colored images, especially photos. These are cost effective as compared to laser printers. Projector A projector is an output device that takes images generated by the computer and displays them on a big screen. Storage Devices Hardware It is a storage device and has flat circular plates made of aluminium or glass that can store huge amount of data. DVD it stands for Digital Versatile Disk. It is used for data storage, recording and play audios and videos. Pen Drive It is also known as USB stick and that uses flash memory and can store a lot of data and applications. It is also used to copy and move data from one computer system to another. Memory Card It is a small chip like device that stores electronic data. It can also be inserted into a smartphone. 
प्रोसेसिंग डिवाइसेस सीपीयू सीपीयू स्टैंड्स फॉर सेंट्रल प्रोसेसिंग यूनिट इट इज आल्सो कॉल्ड द ब्रेन ऑफ द कंप्यूटर एज मोस्ट ऑफ द फंक्शनिंग ऑफ द कंप्यूटर टेक्स प्लेस इन दिस पार्ट it also controls all the other parts of the computer cpu has three part arithmetic and logic unit alu this unit is responsible for all the arithmetic and logical operations of the computer memory unit mu this unit is responsible for storing all the information on the computer The memory can be volatile and non-volatile. Control unit CU. This unit controls the functioning of all the other units such as MU, ALU and devices. Remember it. The CPU sends signals to control the other parts of the computer almost like how a brain controls a body. software softwares are the applications stored in the computer that we cannot see and touch these are the set of instructions data or programs that enables computer to work example of software are ms excel ms word tux paint and many more the software can be of two types system software System software is designed to run a computer's hardware and provides a platform for applications to run. Example: operating system. Application software. An application is a software that fulfills a specific need or performs task. Example: Paint, Excel, Games, Word, etc. Microsoft Excel. Microsoft word get thank you right i for input devices and o for the output devices keyboard microphone printer let's recall a computer system parts are divided into two groups namely hardware and software hardware is the parts of the computer that we can see and touch Software includes the application of the computer that we cannot see and touch. Hardware is further classified into input, output and storage devices. Software is classified as system software and application software. Monitor, printer, speaker and projector are output devices. Keyboard, mouse, microphone and web camera are input devices hard drives dvds and usb drives are storage devices upskill your intelligence a identify and name the following storage devices 1 pen drive 2 dvd 3 hard drive 4 memory card b fill in the blanks 1 Dash software is designed to run computers hardware and provides a platform for applications answer system 2 CPU stands for answer central processing unit 3 dash can also work as photocopiers answer printers 4 Dash monitors consume 40% less power than LCDs. Answer: LED. 5. Dash captures still pictures and motion videos. Answer: Web camera. C. Answer the following questions. 1. What are output devices? Explain with examples. The devices which are used to display print and show the results after processing are called output devices monitors printer speaker and projector are output devices to explain system software and application software in detail answer 
system software is designed to run a computer's hardware and provides a platform for applications to run. Example Operating System An application is a software that fulfills a specific need or performs tasks. Example Paint, Excel, Games, Word, etc. 3. Why are LED monitors more economically than LCD monitors? Answer LED monitors have a better display. They are thinner and lighter in weight. They consume 40% less power than LCD. This is why LED monitors are more economically than LCD monitors. 4. Explain any two storage devices. Answer Memory card. It is a small chip like device that stores electronic data. It can also be inserted into a smartphone. DVD It stands for Digital Versatile Disk. It is used for data storage, recording and play audios and videos. 5. How many types of printers are there? Explain Answer There are three types of printers. Laser printer, inkjet printer and solid ink printer. D. Write down the full form of the following abbreviations. 1. ALU stands for Arithmetic and Logic Unit. 2. DVD stands for Digital Versatile Disk. 3. CRT stands for Cathode Ray Tube. 4. LED stands for Light Emitting Diode 5. LCD stands for Liquid Crystal Display E. Write T for True Statements and F for False Statement 1. ALU stands for Arithmetic and Logic Units Answer True 2. There are 10 alphabet keys on a keyboard Answer False 3. Laser and inkjet are the type of printers. Answer True. 4. Mouse and microphone are output devices. Answer True. 5. CRT, LED, and LCD are the types of monitors. Answer True. F. Take the correct answer. 1. Which is not hardware. A. Keyboard B. Mouse C. Monitor D. Microsoft Excel Answer D. Microsoft Excel 2. Which is not a type of monitor screen? A. LED B. LCD C. CRT D. ALU Answer D. ALU 3. Dash takes images generated by a computer and displays them on a big screen. A. Projector B. Hard drive C. Monitor D. Light pen Answer A. Projector 4. Which is not a part of the CPU? A. ALU B. CU C. CRT D. MU Answer C. CRT 5. This software fulfills a specific need or performs tasks. A. Application B. System C. Speaker D. Hard drive Answer A. Application Critical thinking A. Who am I? 1. I am the most commonly used layout of the keyboard. Answer Query 2. I am responsible for all the arithmetic and logical operation of the computer. Answer ALU 3. CRT, LED and LCD are my types. Answer Monitor 4. I can show images on the big screen. Answer Projector 5. ALU, CU and MU are my paths. Answer CPU
B. Identify the devices below and classify them as input, output and storage devices. 1. Output device 2. Input device 3. Output device 4. Input device 5. Output device 6. Input device 7. Input device Team Work as is, which of the following devices are present in your computer lab? Use the lines below to write the names of the devices. Also draw pictures of the same. Type of mouse. Type of printer. Type of monitor. Answer. Do it yourself.